Hi there, it's Dr. David Green, founder and CEO of R3 Stem Cell, the global leader in regenerative therapies. Today I'm discussing the latest in umbilical cord stem cell therapy for knee arthritis. A recent study was just published in a journal called Cytotherapy, looking at one dose of cryopreserved human umbilical cord stem cells for the treatment of knee arthritis. Now, this research study was done prospectively, it was randomized, and it was double-blinded, meaning neither the doctor nor the participant knew what treatment they were getting. So, it was 30 patients who were randomized either to get a steroid injection in a knee or the umbilical cord stem cells. You know, people ask us all the time, well, what's the effectiveness of treatment for arthritis? Internationally, we do these cases all the time. It's been one of the most effective treatments to help people avoid surgery, reduce pain, and gain more function. But how much data has there been over the years to support that? Well, this study was just published in a peer-reviewed journal called Cytotherapy, and it looked at a single dose of either steroid, or the other group was randomized to umbilical cord stem cells in one knee, looking at over a year, how much pain relief, how much function was improved. They did MRIs to see if there was more or less cartilage. It was a very well done study. When you look at studies, this is called a level one evidence study. All right, 30 participants randomized to either group, equal number in each. The average age of the participants was 63 years old. The umbilical cord stem cells that were used were cultured under GMP conditions. Basically the same as what we do, which is the highest standard globally, okay? They used third passage stem cells, which is great. We use third, fourth, or fifth passage. As long as it's not sixth or above, it's very high quality. With regard to adverse events, they did not have anything significant happen in either group. There were no infections, no pseudo-infections where you get a lot of swelling and redness. No, just some minor aches and pains from having the injection done. Now at each point in time with follow-ups, whether it was three months, six months, nine months, or 12 months, there was a significant difference in the outcomes between the umbilical cord stem cell group versus the steroid group in all of the variables looked at. Pain relief, functional improvements. Now the group that received the umbilical cord stem cells received a dose of five million stem cells, upwards of 10 million stem cells. Now when they looked at the pain relief throughout the year with the umbilical cord stem cells, it got as high as 71% pain reduction at two months, and at a year, it held at 50%. So still very effective. So at the one year point, there was approximately a 50% reduction in pain with the stem cell group versus a 12% reduction in pain with the steroid group. Not even a comparison, right? All this study is a wonderful addition to our body of clinical evidence showing that umbilical cord stem cells are a fantastic option for those patients who have arthritic pain and are looking for a non-surgical option. R3 stem cell has clinics in seven countries. We do these procedures internationally all the time for patients who have not only arthritis but over 50 other conditions. We've done over 26,000 procedures around the world. We're the world's largest provider of regenerative therapies and the most affordable, too. Visit us today online at r3stemcell.com and then call us to get your free consultation at plus one eight four four get stem or email us at info at r3stemcell.com.